Hey, what's up, everybody around the world? Wired, how is everybody doing today? I hope you're all doing okay, living well with good health. I would like to introduce myself. I'm Edilberto Jr. Carreño, here in Tampa, Arizona, Branch 80, putting in work for us, safe for number one, without the E. To not get it confused with the girls you read. This is scaffolding, access, and solutions. Here to explain 10 nice seven rules, things that you need to be doing. Starting off with number one, you need to follow every single tie off requirement. See, no, they send you para tu domicilio. Go home, is what they tell you to do. If you don't follow, you might fall off and get hurt. It might be a scratch, you might break up on your mic. Break up on you, might break up on you, never know, you never share because even death gonna care, death gonna care, death gonna care. So it's better if you just tell you off 100% at all times. Leave all of the I am so tough and so rough behind. These are new times. I also advise to follow all alcohol and drug policy. Show up to work ready for action. If you come into work drunk, your reaction is losing all of your energy, getting dehydrated. Can't hang because last night you were all faded. Take it easy, save the drinking for the weekend, and just leave them drugs alone. Not before you even think about operating any type of vehicles or equipment. Only do so if you have proper training and or authorization when you're facing a safety device. Never bypass because then you could spend the rest of your life disabled, not able to provide for your family. Don't mean to get deep, but you gotta think about reality. Take it seriously or else you won't have authorization to lie. Stop. Wait a minute. Is this a football field? Never throw when they bury your runners in vertical post. Or else find yourself a hospital bed. Host most of these newbies. Take this as a joke. Once again, take it seriously or else you won't have authorization to life. Stay in concentration cause I'm spreading the rhyme. Explaining the rules. These 10 life saving rules. Stay in concentration cause I'm spreading the rhyme. Explaining the rules. These 10 life saving rules. Stay in concentration cause I'm spreading the rhyme. Explaining the rules. These 10 life saving rules. That was only number one to five. Now follow me to number six. As I put in a little twist. Also with confined spaces, only into with proper training and authorization. When around, we're working around high voltage weather with electrical danger. Don't be a stranger and follow the appropriate rules. You are not a bird. If you touch, you'll end up toasted like a hanger in shape of a triangle. Number eight should be number one. No one should begin work without having on the correct PPE before entering any job site. You should already have your hard hat, safety glasses, steel toe boots on. Then expect all fall protection PPE prior to use. Don't refuse. Lack of concern, you get you hurt, but you'll receive a nasty burn. If you fall, all it takes is for five minutes to do. A rush should be used as a perfect example of what not to do. Snap goes your harness, snap goes your lanyards, and now you're injured, fool, not cool. So now you gotta report the injury, no matter the severity, all injuries immediately to your supervisor or the lead man in charge of the J-O-B. Always stop the work if you feel rushed, if you feel pressured, if you feel tired, or even if you're in need of water. If there's an unsafe act, don't act like you don't see. Stop the work and let everybody see that you're a safe for your employee, concerned for his life, your life, and everybody's life. Stay alive by following these 10 life-saving rules.